Okay, now I'm going to hook up the, the, the um, stuff from the top here, the USB ports and the audio and power buttons, and they're all labeled and already ran underneath here. Pretty well done. Um, this looks like a SATA cable. This is, if you look here, they're actually labeled HD audio, AC97, and they have the same configuration there. This one is uh, USB, and this one is also USB, and then the blue one's USB 3.0, but my, this motherboard doesn't support USB 3.0, so I'm not going to be able to use it. I'll end up just stuffing it somewhere. I'll hide it in here somewhere. Maybe I'll just pull it back through. Um, but if you look here, you know, there's actually pins where each one goes. They're all the same except these two here. Or this one, actually, I should say. And none of them are labeled on here. Oh yeah, they are USB, USB, USB. And then this one must be, oh, this is an LED. And this one is also the same. So, also will the USBs. Um, right here's one. Now I'm trying to keep the cables untangled and clean here. With everything flowing together, so this one is on the right. And then we just plug it right in there. Nice and easy. That one's in. Then we got another USB. We'll push that one so all these cables line up. Then I'll end up pushing them back down to hide the cables a little better. And then we got USB 3, but this one, it's not a 3.0, it's just a third slot. Then we got our LEDs here, we got power LED, power switch, hard drive LED, and reset switch. And these ones all will go right in here. So we got LEDs, right there, LED here's power switch. Let's see, they're, they're, it's labeled really, really small in here. You have to get really close to see what on the motherboard it says. It says PLED, HDD, restart, power. So, this power, although, it's only showing two pins there. We got sad over here, too. Yeah. Okay, let's start with, let's see here, we got reset switch. Okay, if you look in your manual, it'll, in your motherboard manual, it'll tell you uh, what the connectors are for. Um, then you know where to put them, because they're all labeled. And you can see here, it tells you which one's for the fan, the CD. And right here it tells you the front panel connectors, it tells you the power switch, the power LED, and which ones they need to go into. And I hooked them up down here according to what it says. And then after that you have all of your fan components hooked up except for the power, so we're going to do the power next.